So I'm taking a bit of a detour from my uh, planned how to work core values thing because I had an experience yesterday and um, that's kind of why I want to start these daily because it's an idea rattling around in my head and I, I want to get it out. So I um, visited a co-working space yesterday and they have uh, free coffee which is awesome and uh, I went to go get some coffee and they had two coffee urns and I uh, went to the first one, it was empty. Uh, second one uh, also was like, eh, yeah, I got like a, maybe an inch. Uh, of coffee in the bottom of my cup. So I went to the, the volunteer at the front desk and uh, said, uh, actually, I don't know paid staff or, or volunteer. And I said, uh, hey, you know, uh, word of coffee or the, uh, and uh, he uh, said in, in a way that I'm sure he has said thousands of times, uh, you know, it's up to the, the members and the guests to, to make their own coffee, which uh, I don't have a problem with. Uh, one of our core manifesto uh, pieces is uh, fill your mind in the coffee pot. Uh, literally baked it into our manifesto uh, that we need to refill the coffee pot. Uh, so anyway, walked through the process and, and got shown how to make the coffee and uh, went back to work um, and uh, came back out on the way out and I uh, thought, well, you know what, on, on the way out, I was only there for a couple hours, I thought, uh, you know, I'll, I'll top up on coffee and uh, to my uh, lack of surprise, uh, the coffee pot was once again empty and um, the reason that I wasn't surprised and the reason that we put it into our manifesto is all too frequently we don't fill the coffee pot and uh, it's a, a literal and a metaphoric uh, line in our manifesto and basically what it means is if the, the pot is empty make a new pot uh, and it's amazing how many times uh, this gets missed. And I know like when we see the empty coffee pot or we have that last cup and we're late for a meeting, we're rushing to the next thing, we always think, well, my time's really important and I can't do this thing right now. I can't fill the coffee pot. Someone else will fill it. Well, guess what? The next person who comes in line is also in a hurry, is also late for a meeting. And uh, they are now conflicted with the choice of uh, not having coffee and taking the time to fill the pot or walking away in disgust from the empty coffee pot. Uh, here's what I'll tell you about leaders. Uh, the leaders will make the next round of coffee. Uh, it has been a shocking observance in my 20 years of, of working in companies, being in companies, uh, the leaders of the organization are typically the ones that will empty the dishwasher, that will make sure that the pot of coffee, uh, pot of coffee gets filled. And the reason I believe that happens is uh, leadership is a, is a thing. You can be promoted to a manager, you can be promoted, you can, given, uh, you can be given authority, but you can't be made a leader. Leadership is inherent in what we do. And a good leader sees the needs of the team and responds as they sense and respond um, to use uh, imagining, reimagining organizations, languages, but um, they sense and respond and they do whatever that needs. If that could be literally taking out the garbage, unloading the dishwasher, or making a new pot of coffee, or it can mean that uh, you go out uh, and you build a team around a particular initiative or, or solve a problem for the organization. And so I can't in my organization, I can make you a manager, I can give you authority within the organization, but I can't make you a leader. And I've observed over my time that leaders fill the coffee pot. So when it's in our manifesto, it literally means fill the coffee pot because there's nothing more frustrating than going to a coffee maker to get coffee and there's no fresh joe. But it also means attend to the little things, attend to the uh, things. Don't make your own agenda more important than any one of your other team members. and. You know, I think if you can go to a lot of different leadership training, you can get a lot of paid courses, you can go to all sorts of schools that will teach you how to be a better leader, and those are great activities. But I can give you like a free advice thing right now. Uh, if you want to start being a leader, fill the coffee pot. It's like right here. Ooh, yeah, yeah. It's empty. Fill it. That's your first step to being a leader. Take care.